<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to um, what we've now called normal turkey. It's normal to us because, well, it's raining all the time. We've probably had, what, about five days? Five days, six days, maybe good weather? Maybe a week. It's yeah. a week. Be positive. <laughs> and uh, last few days, it's been monsoon weather. Oh, so much so it's been um, flooding in the back garden. Yeah, the pool's filled up. <laughs> the pool's filled up. <laughs> it was overflowing last <laughs> night. So we're just off out today to uh, get some gousle mey. Bit of a fail on the gousle mey front. I think the rain has shut a lot of places down. Yeah. It's still raining. It's quite bad actually because I don't think Turkey's prepared for rain on the proportions they've been getting. So the grids are overflowing. Yeah, they? the grids are literally gushing and the fields are all, they all look like rice paddies, yeah. don't they? They are absolutely flooded to heck. So, so we've like gone for um, cheese toasties and chips. Mm. And a chicken wrap. Yeah, well, I'm having Menemen. Menemen. Because that's amazing. Oh, okay. So, uh, well, Menemen. Yes. <laughs> for our semi failed mission to get some food, which the food was nice. We are now at the bread shop. So we've got to choose whichever nice bread we want now. Choose one that's suitable for making garlic tear and share bread. Oh yeah, that one then. So I'm thinking that one there. Yeah. Not the middle one. That one. Oh right, I'll go for the middle one because it's got the segments to it. I know, but then no. 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 You know nothing. You just get whatever now. suits. <laughs> yeah. Well, that smells nice. Oh, it does. So just want to stand in and sniff Apple up. cookies. Oh. oh, I've got to have some apple cookies. Mm -mm. This is why you're not allowed out with me when I go to the bread shop. <laughs> come on, so what do we get? Oh, I was so tempted. We're being very good. We'll come back and pick something else another day. I got these apple slices. Oh, yeah, they look good. So they smell amazing. I figured we can share one of those and then cut some each can share one of those. And that smells oh, amazing. Yeah. The whole yeah. place smells amazing. I was going to say, when you're in there looking at all the breads and everything, it's like, oh, very nice. Yeah. And all those little cookie things, so we're going to have to come in the right assortment of the little cookie things. Yeah. yeah. Right, come on then, let's get going back. Yep. I imagine it's very, very hot. <laughs> What's you made for us then? Mushroom risotto with hedgehog cheesy garlic bread. Ooh, thank bon you. Bon appetit. Looks amazing. Yeah. Sheriff again. Sheriff. 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 Oh, oh, oh. oh. Sheriff. My arm's getting tired from cheersing. So, oh, oh, <laughs> so oh, oh, oh. many times. <laughs> Got such big like gin biceps in this arm now. All the cans come with a foil lid over here, by the way. Which I love. Mm. Just it's like cool. rip it cleanliness, off. isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I've only got one bit. That's not good enough. Well, that disappeared first. And so did most of that. <laughs> Thank you, that was really nice. You're very welcome. We're not fatties, I promise, but it was just really nice. <laughs> He's going to finish the tiger bread. Tiger bread? Mm. Hedgehog. Hedgehog. Bread. Hedgehog. Oh, there's four pieces left and everything. Oh, it's like oh. fate arose. I guess I like goes lemme again. <laughs> <laughs> I donate my piece. Oh, wow. Oh, that full, eh? Bye bye villa, bye bye van. Today we're all going on a boat cruise. Woohoo! Boat cruise day! Boat cruise day, I had to have a nervous poo and everything for Oh me. man. So this is going to be our little boat for today. again like a pro <laughs> well, for now anyway
Lovely little boat ride. I think that's like literally one of my favourite boat rides. That yeah. was beautiful. Very calm. Yes. Flat water as well, so I presume you felt okay? Yeah, I did. I felt fine, apart from there was uh, one boat that went past a bit fast. Oh, yeah. A bit that of was, wake. Woo! But yeah. So. Yeah, that was very, very good. Lots of wildlife as well. You know, oh, I yeah. like about seeing all the birds and stuff. There was egrets and herons and shags, and an eagle flew out of the bushes as well, which amazing. was amazing. So, yeah, made up with that. That's brilliant. We've made it down to Turtle Beach, which is totally free of turtles. <laughs> it is totally. That's the only reason why we're allowed Cooper on it because yeah. it's out of season and there's nothing there's no for us yet. to worry about. So, well, it's a lovely beach. I can see why they made it their home to come yeah. back here. Good choice, turtles. Yeah, well Good done. Choice. So yeah, we're going to have a bit of a walk round. The guys uh, give us a shout. It says, uh, "Come back one hour." So, in an hour, we'll go back back up the river, uh, possibly get some lunch. And then um, maybe go up to the, what's it called, the lake, isn't it? The lake, yeah, I think we've got some ruins. Oh, right, okay um, then. Before we get back to Dalian. Ooh. But we'll all be, we'll all be hungry and... Rubble, and, you mean? Rubble, yes. Rubble. We're going to look <laughs> for some rubble. Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, I think we'll all be hungry by then, so we'll need to stop off at Dalian for some food and then we'll head yeah. up to the lake. At least that's the whole thing, anyway. But we were really kind of like anxious because we were watching the weather for this day. We booked it for today, uh, Monday the 27th, just seeing how up to date we are. Um, and the weather's been like, it's going to rain, it's not going to rain, it's going to be nice, it's going to be cloudy, it's going to be cold, it's going to rain. So, fortunately, as you can see, it's bloody lovely. Yes. It is. It literally is. I don't think it could be. If it was any warmer, it probably would be sunbathing, not sunbathing weather, but well, just sit-out right, yeah. weather. <laughs> but, uh, no, I prefer it to be like this and comfortable. It's about 15 degrees. Yeah, I think we need to head down to that shoreline because I'm fairly sure that somebody fairly would sure. like to go for a paddle. Shall we? Shall we go see him on the beach? Yeah. Go on then. On the boardwalk and we're having some fun on the boardwalk in the serious sun. Yay! The, not the words, but I'll let you off. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Found these little turtle eggs. Obviously, no inhabitants in them anymore. But yeah, it feels like paper. Yeah, very soft and pliable. Yeah. Nice little beach cafe as well. Mandy's there having a coffee. Could almost be on a tropical island in the Caribbean or something like that. Oh, I know. All of the grass topped huts and the beautiful mountains and the sea. Palm trees. I can't believe it. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's mega, isn't it? Definitely, definitely a good place to stop for a coffee. Yeah. Totally great. Totally great. <laughs> Before you know it, the hour's up. We're off back on the boat. Aye. Well, it was a good walk round that. That was lovely. It was great to see it with um, all the turtles and things, or see the hatching. Yeah. But finding those eggs was pretty cool as well. Oh, the eggshells, yeah. That's just like, I never would have thought that they were that delicate mm. at all. So, yeah, that was a little bit of an eye-opener. Really good. Lovely. It must be amazing in the height of season, though. Yeah, to see them all. Yeah. But now, off to see some rubble. Rubble! Golden water. So we've all just been spotted, the fishermen over there. We got off the uh, little boat to come see the ruins. Everyone gets the camera gear out and he says, uh, you have a YouTube channel? <laughs> <laughs> so we gained a new subscriber. Yay! Yay! The forecast said it was cold today, which is why we've got big coats and hats and everything. It's 
staking, <laughs> melting. Apparently, we know something about this place. Mm. Or at least Mandy does anyway. A little bit, very little bit. So I think Kaunos is the name of a set, one of a set of twins. So there is another person, obviously, because there's twins, and there was Kaunos. And the girl twin fell in love with her brother and wanted to have a relationship with him. I've seen this one. Have you? Yeah, Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe it was a takeoff of this story. Yeah. yeah. Um, but he wasn't that? having any of it at all. So he left. Ah, right. And when he left, uh, she cried so much that it made the river. Oh, okay. Something. Cry me a river. Yeah. There we go. See, there we go. We've got Justin Timberlake and Game of Thrones <laughs> all within one history lesson from Turkey. Kaunos in Turkey. Yeah. You heard it here, folks. <laughs> Always the best information. Shekel for an excellent battle. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, he's not the messiah. He's a very naughty boy. These Romans have big legs. It's quite impressive really that. This one is going to sleep very well. Run on the beach, walk up some steps. Watch Daddy in an amphitheatre. It's very quiet in here. It's like the perfect place to record. Apart from that forest in Poland. What do we think? Ooh. Oh no! That's just mean. <laughs> Treat ladies feeding the goats now, I think. I thought that was really, really good. I do like myself some ruins, even though I don't really quite understand them, but they were very well preserved and there was lots of signs telling you all about it. So it's definitely worth a visit if you really like this kind of thing. So we are now just walking down this other little promenade. Let me show you behind me. There's John. Say hi, John. Hi, hi John. John. And behind John is our little boat. So I just walk along here, but it's beautiful because it's just this little stone path that kind of clings to the, the rest of the rocks where the ruins are. No, baby, not on there. And of course, Cupid wants to go walking in the mud. Um, yeah, beautiful, stunning location, really well preserved. So if you do like seeing these kind of um, ruins and things, then give them a visit. So that is a fish gate. I don't know if it's to keep the fish up river or down river or whatever. But yeah, how cool is that? Little fish barrier. Stop the little fishes escaping. Or scoffing all the food where it's, they're not supposed to scoff. Who knows? So whilst I'm looking at editing the video, Mandy checked out what the fish gate's all about. Fish gate. Did you know a fish gate is called... A Dalian. So that's where the name of the town came from because the fish gates were there before apparently and uh, the fish gates got the name 2,000 years ago so they were saying obviously I don't know this for sure um, but it's a fish weir is what it translates to essentially and apparently there's migratory fish that go up to the lake at the top and then they lay all their eggs and everything and then they all migrate back down again but the fish weir stops them from reaching the sea and then they catch them all and put them in that big fishery that we show at the side of the Kaunos ruins. Just as we're walking in, you can see the fish way there. And that's where it catches them all and they put them in the big fishery. Cool. So there you go, bit of history. It was a Dalian on the Dalian River on the way to Dalian. <laughs> Back to the Dalian vlog. Yeah, so there's some fishy going on there anyway. Better check that out as well. Because like I say, we don't have a lot of stuff that's knowledge and words and stuff like that. <laughs> you can't even say the name of the town properly. Um, the problem is, I'm looking and I'm seeing the the pattern. Look at the pattern in the water behind us. Oh, yeah. The weight we're leaving and it's putting me off. <laughs> Doesn't take a lot. You're like a magpie. Yeah. Ooh, shiny. We are stronger and stronger. Rain 
there's so much we've also almost got an infinity pool now hopefully we won't get charged extra for that and today is supposed to be over 40 millimeters of rain if you look there the gardens flooded over the back there but um, yeah i just thought i'd show you the crazy weather we're having here in turkey um, on and off now for about the last uh, well months since we arrived um, not quite the winter in turkey that we'd all hoped for certainly assumed quite wrongly as well and that it'd be all sunshine and sunny days but hey oh make the most of what you've got don't you still in turkey so on a rainy day catch up on youtube and have some snacks yeah lots of snacks cuddles with cooper and um, Mandy's just got a text off three that says, oh, by the way, because you've been out of the UK for more than three months. That you're going to suspend your roaming service. Yeah, stuff you. <laughs> the joys of travel. Yeah. Yes. Good old three. Mm. Really know how to look after the customers, don't they? Yep. So. Um, I'm out of contract anyway, so bye, yeah. when you get back, three. Well, it's either that or you fly back to the UK, ring me to say I'm back in the UK. And then come back again. Oh yeah, that's it. I only need PCR tests and whether I can actually fly out again and I might get stuck in England. What? Like, they're getting stuck right now because of PCR tests. Uh, and, and other things. Yeah. Oh well. Back to snacks and cuddles, eh, Mookie? This is our penultimate day of being in a villa. And it's the last day of 2021 as well. Currently putting a bit of water in, I've emptied all the water out, cleaned all the tanks out, uh, trying to reorganise a bit of bit bobs that go in the boot, um, taking all the bedding off, including the covers for the bedding and um, the mattresses and that. They're getting a wash over, all the floors have all been cleaned up. So yeah, a bit of a maintenance time for the van. Um, later tonight, we're going to get some shenanigans going on, as you do, New Year's Eve, you know, it'd be rude not to. Um, and Philly and Keeley from Chapter by Chapter are coming as well, so they're going to join us. And yeah, tomorrow, probably hangover day to be fair, which is why we're trying to do everything today. Um, and then on the second, we shoot off and we uh, carry on travelling. So yeah, can't wait, can't wait to get back on the road again, get exploring. And let me just show you the sky. Blue sky! Oh, it's so nice to see a bit of blue sky again. Now the pool has taken all the water from the sunshine that it would have got, you see? Yeah, it's true. So before you go in, how cold is the pool? 10 degrees. Never. Oh, positively balmy. Okay. Okie dokie. Are we ready? Okay. One, two, two three, three, go. Oh my god. Oh, it's oh, it? it? oh Jesus. You're getting out already. Oh, I'm oh, getting back in, but I'm getting out. So cold. Don't sit in the hot tub end. Oh, that's colder than the fjord. <laughs> really? Yeah. That is colder than any water we've been in. Oh, oh, I couldn't catch my breath. So I've got a good uh, question for you both though. Yeah? yeah. Was it worth sixty pounds? <laughs> <laughs> it might have been a little bit more than that. I think was it was sixty pounds each we paid. Is it sixty pounds each? We paid sixty quid or whatever it was. Oh my god. For the use of the pool. We used it. So yes, you've so used it's it once. fine. Oh, yeah? I'm gonna go back in. <laughs> I would rather just throw in an ice bucket over you, that would be better. Oh, <laughs> well, that would have been more satisfying. Oh. I'm getting my money with. <laughs> you crazy lady. Oh. Is that a bit warmer? I'm in the hot tub now. Yeah. Is it hot? No, I can't stay in. Oh. I can't stay in. Wow. Jesus. Oh. Oh. Oh, I think the legs are gonna fall off. <laughs> oh. It's meant to be good for you. It was better second time, by the way. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to well water, done, up, I've got water up my nose the second time, mate. Thank you. Oh, look. All civilised. 
I'd just like to point out as well to everyone that it is 18 degrees, 19 degrees it is whoop, right whoop, now. Whoop. So Not it probably gives you about three degrees of water, doesn't it? Because it <laughs> has been in the sun for maybe two hours today. And don't forget, it is the 31st of December. It is, it's quite crucial. And yesterday looked very different than this. Oh my goodness, it did. Yesterday, the pool was overfilling because it was peeing it down that mm. much, so. Well done. Thank you. You doing it tomorrow morning as well? Yeah. Yeah? I think it'd be a nice refreshing New Year's swim. Oh, you need to do a job in a second because I'm too cold. Okay. But we've made the leaves come back up so they'll be easier to... Okay, oh, clean the pool. To clean the pool, I'll yeah. be pool boy then, shall you I? Be, go on, pool boy. <laughs> Off your pop. Time to say goodbye. It's Time not to say goodbye. It's oh. not gully gully. It's gurishurus. Gurishurus. <laughs> How do you say see you next week? Oh, what? <laughs> Easy. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be in a few weeks' time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm level two of Bye. Bye. <laughs> yeah, we've got to bye. Oh, oh, it's been amazing. So, so good, thank that? you so much. Pretty damn good. It's yeah. been a good laugh. One whole month. Really has. One whole month. Yeah. I know, I can't I believe know. it. We're going to have to go back to talking to one another all the time. I think we'll make some silence. Oh, okay. So we're going to sit in silence. We're going to miss you, buddy. Can you we're going to miss that Coop. They're not going to miss us. Coop. 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 Just going to miss Coopy. Yeah. Oh. Bye, buddy. Before they left, Philly and Keely gave a quick tour of their van, Martha. If you've not watched them already, the YouTube channel and their Instagram account is chapter by chapter. I'll link them in the video description down below. Um, but yeah, it's a wonderful van. Obviously, it's the same as our previous van on the outside, but what they've done on the inside with their own conversion makes it far more spacious than we had space-wise in our last van. So, yeah, it's really cool. Oh, I mean, you, see, you say she's small. I mean, she's smaller than ours, but, my God, it's a good build. I like the, I like the layout. Oh, is this the box that you did in the BG? Yeah, that's the box. So, this is modular then, so this can't go anywhere. So, it can either turn around to there, or it can go in here, and then these fold down, and then put that stuff there. Oh, no. Yes, I love it. Oh, you can take this out. It went really well. Maybe it didn't even enough. feel like a squeeze. Yeah, oh, it was so nice. good. Oh, and is that, is, that, is the Christmas wreath staying? Uh, well, no, he won't let me let it stay, but it gets to stay until like the 6th of the January. 6th, yeah. yeah. The 6th of January, yeah. It's got to. <laughs> but you made it all yourself. The down early, you told me that. Bye. We then waved goodbye to Cuts and Meeks, got in our van and set off. But you're going to find out next week where we ended up. And it is a cracking spot. That that you can see in the distance over there, that is Dalyan. And the little river you can see meandering its way around this way is where we went on our boat trip. And then you can just see at the end of this spit of sand here, there's some buildings and that's the Turtle Beach.